Welcome back everyone. Well, I've got a review for you today and I've got to say this one is courtesy of Otterbox. They sent this to me as a free sample to review and uh, and thank you Otterbox for this. This was a lot of fun to kind of do this one. So this is what comes with it when you get it. It comes with this tag. This is the Pursuits 40. It's a Pursuit series. They actually have a smaller one. It's the 20. I would definitely recommend this size. Uh, this one's already small enough, and uh, or quite small, I should say. The box that's smaller than this is probably going to be just dedicated for a smartphone or a GPS or just some type of electronic, just one device only. This you're able to kind of get some other things in there, and it comes with this little, this little, it's like a strong rubber band basically, and it was kind of set up in a lanyard formation when you get it. I think that's even probably how they display it or hang it in the store. Something something like this. You know, you just kind of wrap it around and it's like that. But I kind of like it around just the whole body. It does provide a little bit of extra security around that latch. And the latch is a big win, I will say. It is uh, real easy to kind of get open. Just one big solid latch you can open. I do have some things in here right now. You can see, didn't leak, which is good. Man, I have put this thing through the ringer too. I drug it behind my truck and uh, hit it with a hammer, kind of like baseball swinging style. Uh, it did well. I think I found the weakest point on the box, and I'll roll in a picture of that. What happened was, I must have hit it right here somewhere on this area. And if you see this one lanyard, it's just this one spot. And when it did that, it kind of it chipped this off, and uh, which was bad because this gasket here wouldn't seal properly with this broken. What I ended up doing is getting some super glue to repair that that spot. And uh, it's you know it's holding, it's strong again, and now this gasket, this seal works, so it's waterproof again. Let me go ahead and take some of this out. And uh, I got some good hits on it too. I don't know if you can see that right here. Got got a hammer swing there. Uh, hit it with a hammer here as well, right on the latch. The latch is good and strong. I, I'm really impressed with the latch. It's real easy to open. If your hands were cold or whatever, you're not fumbling around. Even with gloves, you can just kind of get in there and, and get it open. So I'm, I'm really impressed with the latch. It does come in other colors. You can get them in clear which I do like that. You could easily see what's in here. Uh, in the past I've used bags like uh, like right here. I've used like this Eagle Creek and it does have like a plastic membrane. I still use these. But it's not fully waterproof. If you were to submerge it here the around the zipper area it will get wet and I was out on a, a good hike. Got caught in the rain. Hiked the whole way in the rain. Some of my gear got wet this could be a uh, not only a waterproof option it's going to be heavier obviously than something like this or even just something like a freezer bag but what, what you do have here is you do have added security of a hard case I really am impressed also with how tough the plastic is it really held up well to some abuse you know I wonder if they could just remove this you do have the lanyard point over here if you wanted to hook a carabiner or tie cord to it, you can also work in some cordage under these areas as well. You can see here where things got scuffed up when I was dragging it. So there's a lot of options on as far as tying it down. It's a good case. I'm going to give it a thumbs up. And uh, Otterbox said that they were good with me reviewing this good or bad and do whatever I wanted to with it. So that's what I did. I, uh, I took it out, used it and uh, abused it and I was actually harder on this than I am on on my gear normally I mean I'm not going to go out there and abuse my stuff but I wanted to kind of see what this thing could handle and uh, it's, it's a tough little box which is the goal you want something that's going to keep it dry and keep things secure put your phone in there wouldn't worry about it at all you do have this it's kind of like a cargo net that kind of keeps it up and out of the way 
and uh, it's like a little safe. There you go, guys. Thanks for watching. As always, thanks for the comments, and take care.